I'm Karen. Recently, my daughter, Brittany, started to play this game called Animal Jam. And being the responsible parent I am, I decided I needed to ensure this game is a safe environment for my daughter. Not to brag, but I already limited her screen time on her phone, check her search history every other hour, and now that I'm the head of the PTA, I can make sure she doesn't become friends with any scandalous teens. Yesterday, I saw her talking to someone with purple hair. Can you believe it? The audacity. I had to intervene. Anyways, I'm recording my experience on Animal GM to ensure I have enough evidence to sue the company if something goes wrong, and I have to contact the manager and all. It's a highly useful tactic. It's actually how I was able to afford the Lily Pulitzer dress I'm currently wearing. <laughs> I guess my daughter already took that username. <laughs> <laughs> kind Karen. Perfect! Welcome to your new home! My name is Peck, and I'd like to show you around. Oh. No. No, 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 no. Red flags are already going off. Look, look, look at that hair. Purple hair. This could be a very, very bad influence for my precious daughter. What if my daughter gets purple hair now? My reputation in the PTA and book club will be completely shattered. What will Shannon think? And oh my god. Linda would be heartbroken. How could a children's game suggest such a radical creativity? You know what? That tears it. Hi, I need to speak to the manager ASAP. Your online platform is suggesting deplorable behavior to our children, and if nobody else wants to do anything about it, I will once again have to step in and do all the work for them. What do you mean, who am I? I'm Karen. I literally just made an account. Do you not remember me? You don't monitor who creates an account? Okay, hold on. I need to write this down because my list of grievances is getting longer and longer. I don't care if it's legal to not monitor the login. You know what else is legal in the United States? Getting a tattoo. Obviously the United States legal system is completely out of control. And so are you. Can you please just get me to the manager already? You are the manager? <gasps> okay, can you tell me why upon logging into the game there's a bunny rabbit with purple hair displaying scandalous hair colors encourages disrespectful and rebellious behavior from teens. And I will not have my child witnessing such horrors in a game like yours. Oh, he, he hang up. Okay. Although I can't change that bunny's hair, at least I can make myself look presentable. <laughs> this hair gives you such good vibes, and I just have to have it. Two hours later. The manager was, once again, not interested in my argument on the colored hair, which I think is absolutely ridiculous, and I will not hesitate to jot that down in my lawsuit evidence notepad immediately. Excuse me, I am not a hippie, thank you very much. So that shop didn't have any good clothes, especially compared to a trip to Nordstrom or Lily Pulitzer. I really enjoyed their interior design, though, with all the candles and... and patterns... I'm actually an interior designer myself. Here's my living room. As you can see, I'm just super creative, and the key to interior design, in my opinion, is understanding the space and knowing its identity. Through meditation, I'm able to feel the spirit of the room, and now I've designed it to be, in my opinion, art. Ah! Oh my goodness, look at all these yoga mats. This is just heaven. <laughs> Now, to be honest, I find this color scheme to be a little overwhelming, and I think it might look a little bit better if it looked like this. Linda would just live, laugh, love this place, though. Oh, seems like Uber Eats brought the Applebee's BRB. It seems that I can't find any other problems with this game, but I'm really in the mood to speak to the manager. I'll just have to live, laugh, look a little harder. It seems to me that this game has a little social element to it, so I need to use my spiritual Karen powers to form preconceived notions of all the people behind the screens of these animals. If I feel dyed hair vibes from any of these animals, there's absolutely no way I'd let my daughter on this emotionally damaging website. That person did say please, but that person did not. Ugh! Oh my gosh, they have a furniture shop. Excuse me? This is all hideous. Where are the ECAP pillows? The wooden calligraphy industrial farmhouse wall art. I'm revolted. Wait, this means I can finally speak to the manager. That way I'll feel more important in the world again. Hi, it's me again. I put it on speaker. Ma'am, what is it this time? Not only are there zero coupons or discounts in your furniture stock, but I think your items are teaching children the wrong type of interior design, in my opinion. In my opinion is, of course, fact. These items completely lack taste. Ma'am, you're wasting my time. Excuse me? Excuse me? I'm doing the rest of the world a favor by educating you on what true interior design looks like. We need to inspire children to be correct and not make their homes ugly or informal. I will have you know my lawyer is well equipped to take you down to the courthouse whenever you're ready. You literally have no evidence against me. Mmm! You see, sweetie, that's where you're wrong. I've actually been recording this entire thing and I'm ready to buy an entire Lily Pulitzer store with your money. But I haven't done anything wrong. 
ma'am, can you please leave me alone? I'm, I'm considering calling the police. I've already called the police on you for your crimes. <laughs> okay, I'm calling the police. Wait, what? The police are coming to get me? That is simply not true. In fact, I find it disrespectful of you to assume such malicious things to happen to me. And I think you need to apologize by giving me coupons and discounts. It is true. I just called them on my wife's phone. Listen up, Mr. Manager. The only thing to arrive on my doorstep is going to be my third Uber Eats Applebee's delivery of the day. Thank you very much. Now, I bid you good day. And I hope that with meditation, you can find a better person buried deep inside of you. Some people just think they run the world. Anyways, there's absolutely no way I'm letting my daughter play this game. Mm -mm, no way, Jose. Oh, my Uber Eats is here. Hi, where's my Applebee's? Excuse me? Oh, wait, you aren't the Uber Eats person. Ma'am, we're going to need to... We're going to need you to come down to the station and answer some questions. Excuse me? Excuse me, I'll have you know, I have... Three children and I'm not afraid to use them. Threatening a police officer can lead to serious penalties, ma'am. That's it. I'm calling my lawyer. <laughs> Just follow me, ma'am. You have the right to remain. Shut up! It's time to redecorate my contemporary farmhouse-themed kitchen. <gasps> it's a butter dish that says butter on it, so you know there's butter in the butter dish! I'll put this in my kitchen, and then when Karen comes over, she'll think that my kids gave it to me and that they love me more than hers do. One blessed hot mess. Because <laughs> my family's so quirky. <laughs> we don't have china, we have mason jars. <laughs> I'll take two. <laughs> oh my god, it's so original, so profound, so deep. My life's message, it has so much meaning.